morning everyone I'm glad you're here thank you very much for joining me boy busy day uh, there was a 3.6 earthquake this morning there in California at 6:49 a.m. ports are still coming in Morgan Hill they're saying and I got the fault lines drawn out let's see let's take a look okay we got the Hayward fault zone this would be along the Calaveras fault zone okay let's go back to its location yeah a lot of people have already sent in reports that they felt it 237 people here's a report from San Jose it said they heard it before they felt a quick jolt another one from San Jose shook their bed hard woke them up in evergreen another one says just a quick jolt for about five seconds morgan hill shook their house for about three seconds another one from morgan hill moving earthquake three seconds santa clara one jolt another one from gilroy quick jolt shook the bed another one from san juan Batista. sorry for pronouncing that wrong felt a horizontal short rocking for about two seconds the felt report map all the way to San Francisco uh, South San Francisco let's see here bring this out yeah Milpitas intensity level 2 Mountain View 1 okay San Jose 2 um, San Jose said intensity level three, which means it was felt noticeably indoors, but not always recognized as an earthquake. Standing autos would have been rocking slightly. Vibration like a passing truck. Okay, looks like we got some reports from down by Santa Cruz. Intensity level three. So the energy seems to have traveled. Uh, going southwest it looks like Gilroy yeah how the crops doing there in Gilroy yeah the garlic capital of the world at least it used to be let's bring this out okay we got one here um, angels camp someone felt it there what their gold dredging or just living there um, one report there uh, is that it that looks like that's it could be a foreshock for something much larger any earthquake has a 20 percent chance of being a foreshock uh, these faults they have a uh, dipping towards the west yeah yeah not good if it's so close to the um, Hayward fault yeah that's not good let's see the largest earthquake reported in this area I have marked was in 1984 a 6.2 and then let's see that one caused uh, 21 deaths and 27 people were injured yeah terrible and then 2022 there was a 5.1 that one was caused by locked energy yeah so I imagine quite a few of you felt this earthquake and did not send in reports to USGS. Thank you for sending them to EMSC. Yeah, be aware. It could be a foreshock. I hope not. You are due for a large earthquake in this area. And my earthquake kitty is meowing. Yeah, busy day. So what are your thoughts? Did you feel it? Let me know. What did it feel like? What direction did it seem to travel from? Did you have any damage? did anything knock over or was it just things shaking please put those comments down below thank you very much for watching thank you for subscribing always be prepared for a disaster and i will talk to you later god bless you all bye <music>